Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Stephanie Woodard. Daryl Clark is out for the evening. Our top story this evening. Officials have started an assessment of the Shell drilling rig that withstood harsh weather conditions this past week. Experts spent three hours on the rig checking for damage and getting information for a salvage operation that could still be days or weeks away. Shell's Alaska operations manager Sean Churchfield said the team was limited in the amount of time it could spend on the Kulluk and didn't get a full assessment of whether the seawater was leaking into tanks or other open spaces in the vessel, either from the deck or the hull. It is the estimated 143,000 gallons of diesel fuel and 12,000 gallons of other petroleum products that are on board. Due to this incident, the Natural Resources Defense Council and the Wilderness Society are calling for a halt to federal permits for Arctic offshore drilling. The two groups believe Shell has demonstrated it is not ready to drill in Arctic waters and that the risks are too large to make in one of the most fragile places on Earth.